hello everyone here I have a registration form or you can say user registration form which is built in ASP.NET MVC 5 in this form I have various fields like username password confirm password here we have qualification gender current CTC expected CTC and for expected CTC there is condition or you can say validation it should be between 8 to 12 lakhs email and URL now I need to validate this form now if I click create you see that it has validated the form it contains required field validation for all the fields if I write password as some ASD and confirm password as a now you see that it is again validating password and confirm password and it says they do not match in the same way if I write my expected CTC as 3 it should say salary out of range it will accept the value which is between 8 to 12 same way email address if I pass as some other string it says invalid instead of this if I pass email as this is valid same way this is an invalid URL you see this whereas this is a valid URL so here we have all kind of validations required compare range kind of regular expression we say email and URL so let us see how to perform these validations in ASP.NET MVC 5 so here I have Visual Studio 2013 and I'll go for file new project and you can see there is only one ASP.NET web application so this is the new feature of your Visual Studio 2013 and ASP.NET 4.5 and I'll name it as validation example I'll say okay now here it will ask me whether it is a web form or MVC or web API or single page app SPA or is it SS data I would like to go for MVC or you can say this contains some templates or you can say ready-made pages I need to go for MT MVC app or I can go for MT web form I can go for MT web API as I need to implement the things from scratch I'll go for MT MVC app I'll say okay I get my project in the solution so to create a form or you can say all the fields I need a model so I need a class I'll just right click and say add class I will name it as user say add now I need all the fields in the class so don't worry I'm not going to write the complete class I have class available with me I'll simply drag the code so you can see this I have a simple class called as user with properties like username password confirm password qualification gender current CTC, expected CTC, email and URL now this is my model now I'll go for controller I'll add new controller MVC empty controller and I'll name it as home as this will be the default controller and I'll right click on index I'll say add view I'm going to add an empty view 
without any layout and all this simple now I need the form so I have that form available with me I simply drag and drop it here so here model is user which is available in validations example so I need to simply change this to validation example validations example dot model dot user so this is the model that I am binding normally I can put this code on the top and if you can see this is the simple form with create as action home as controller and form type is post and I have username binded to the label and text box password confirm password qualification and all the fields whenever I say submit so it is going to hit to home controller and create action and I go for home controller I need to put create action simply copy this paste it here and I'll write it as create and this will be HTTP post save this let me put a breakpoint and execute this and see the things moved good so I got a beautiful form with the username password confirm password now there is no validation on this let us see how to apply validation so apply validation it is simple go to your model and if I want to apply a required field validation on username just above the property you add an attribute called as required now this class required class is available in system dot component model dot data annotations so it adds this namespace now if I say required that's it that is enough let me add a default view or you can say some view for create empty view first of all I need to accept the complete model in the form of object so I need to say user view user is a class or it is a model which is available in validations example dot model save this here I need to add a condition that is if model state dot is valid that's it if it is valid then go to that particular view else return view of the same index that means if it is not valid I will be on the same view Let and another breakpoint here so create I'll say f5 you can see that it has validated the form and it is false so it went to the else part and it is on the index again now I want to display a message as well like username is required 
what do i need to do very simple i'll go to the model this is the only place where you can do all these things i'll write as error message is equals to user name required i'll save this here i gave the message and i want to display that message on the index that means just beside this username text box so here i need to say at html dot I have one more helper method that is validation message for it should be same model gives rise to model dot username that's it now things should work as expected I'll say f5 f5 now you can see that there is a message called as username required 